So we'll keep it nice and simple. Hope everyone's camera is set. The first press conference that I'm managing. Yeah, you get three. Don't worry. बाइक चलाने का सपना था, but of course आप जो बोल रहे हैं कि इस लेवल पे चलाने का तो still मैं बाइक चला नहीं सकता हूँ, of course जो टीम हम चाहेंगे कि टीम अच्छा करे बहुत mix of talents है, काफी young riders हैं, काफी experienced riders हैं, जो टीम है वो बहुत अच्छी और अच्छा support मिल रहा है, तो we are expecting कि next year हम अच्छा finish करें, you know I don't want to pressurize anyone कि you have to be the top team or the top two or the th uh, top three. What we want is good preparation from the guys, good support from the uh, technical side. And, you know, whatever the results come, as I always say in cricket, you know, uh, we won't think too much about the result. You know, it's the process and the preparation that's important. Just one. You'll manage? No, no, no. Just invite uh, Amit. And the uh, principal Kawasaki. Uh, no, I would have joined the army. Still, you know, it's my love for the defense forces, so I would have definitely joined the army. Uh, about racing, uh, definitely not because, you know, I would have been more busy there doing something else. Uh, Tony, uh, my question is to you. Like, today you have been captured on as one of the prime actors of India. Can you achieve this from being a small... Well, I play cricket, yeah. and all my devotion is towards cricket, and... You know, I know one thing, whatever is around me is because of cricket and not because of anything else. Uh, the kind of person I am, you know, uh, throughout my life, I've never tried to change myself. I've always kept it simple, be honest, you know, uh, devote yourself to something and then, you know, be focused on that. So I think it's the ethics and the principles that really matter in life and I've kept it really simple, so that has really helped me. So how do you feel you're being considered as one of the prime items? Well, it feels good, good responsibility, and the rest of the answers are the same. Who would like to take that? Yeah. Um, yeah, we're planning on uh, starting a riding academy. Uh, should be based in, in the north, as well as Chennai. Uh, we're going to be working out of uh, Greater Noida and uh, Sri Parambudur. Yeah, I would lie if I said, you know, I would have uh, dreamt of opening a riding school because coming from a small town, you know, uh, for me, when I say I wanted to play cricket, I never thought cricket will be my profession. You know, army was something that I wanted to join and I was, it was like a dream for me. But cricket, you know, everything fell into place. I became a cricketer. I started doing well in first class cricket, then the Lip Trophy and all the following tournaments, so then I got a chance. So frankly, if you ask me, I never thought I'd play for India. As simple as that. So, you know, opening a riding school was definitely never the agenda for me. But now we are in a position where uh, we can do that. And also, you know, people think uh, biking is something that's really dangerous. But, you know, if you follow the rules, do it the right way, you're wearing uh, proper riding equipments and the gears, you know, uh, it's as safe as a car, you know. You may not have 16 airbags in in your bike, but you know, still, I think it's it's quite safe. Uh, 
Well, if you see, you know, there's nothing like that. Uh, it's something that people talk about, but, you know, it's all about the team. Uh, you need to have a good team. You need people to perform on the field. And same applies to the, to the racing. You know, you need to have good riders, good machines, good technical support. And, you know, somebody needing to plan out the strategies as to what needs to be done and all those things. Because, uh, you know, racing is something where the technical assistance is really important, apart from the rider's skill. Because uh, once the rider is in, you know, it's up to him to uh, see what really happens. You know, it may be just an overtaking maneuver, but, you know, if you don't make it and go in front, then you lose valuable seconds that can really cost you. Okay. Uh, good evening. Congratulations, Mahindra Singh Dhoni, for uh, this initiative. Uh, why did you thought of uh, changing the name? Why did you think you should change your name? Well, we thought, you know, uh, maybe MSD RN Racing was quite a big name to follow. Uh, there were some other reasons also. So we thought, you know, let's keep it sweet and simple and Mahi Racing Team India. You know, uh, sounds uh, very good and, you know, it's easy for us. Do you think that it's a lot of country, Mahi? Uh, ki baat hai. Desi vi desi se, uh, uh, mujhe zyada fark nahi hai. Uh, so we just wanted to keep something that's quite simple and a bit catchy. Okay. team mein char log hain, jaisa bataya gaya. Aapke mitra bhi hain, John Abraham. Unko hi le lete aap, uh, ek <laughs> Well, of course, hum log shaam ko uh, ride pe ja sakte hain. Hmm. And still we prefer it that way, you know, so... I don't think we are skilled enough to get into a race. So these are the four riders that you are seeing. You know, they've got the right mix of experience, aggression, and discipline. So, you know, they are the ones who will do the trick for us, apart from the technical support. Uh, John Abram Sir, one-to-one, you don't have to ask the other one. John Abram said that you are a better rider than a bike. How is this? You are both going to go with each other, you have told me. I'll follow rules and regulations. <laughs> Yeah, the, the, the team have factory backing for next year. It's that they've come a long way in a short time. Um, it's fantastic for Kawasaki to enter into the world championship with a, a brand new team that's uh, owned and run um, by Indian. And uh, we're coming here next year for a race as well, which is, which is fantastic. It's my first time here, and it's really like opened my eyes to what's, what's available. And uh, I think they're they'll be able to manage the factory back in. This is where I, I will work with uh, the team, with Kawasaki, with the factory, with the Japanese, um, to make sure that they have the best equipment. Um, I'm moving our current world champion, Keenan, to the team. So I, I don't do that lightly. Um, the team have to be professional. They have to manage everything correctly. Um, and with the potential they have with the two riders, also with Fabian, um, could be a completely dominant season. And uh, this is a stepping stone for them to go up into Superbike as well, which is really, really our main promotion around the world for Kawasaki. Um, this year we came second in the world by half a point, uh, really close. So, you know, next year obviously we're aiming for the title. Um, and to get that takes so many fine details very te technical details, but also human aspect, the staff, how the staff work together with the riders, uh, each track, the information, everything. So the team have got a big, big, big job. Um, and judging by the launch tonight, they're taking it seriously. So um, we're really, really thankful that they've chosen Kawasaki to do that with. Well, personally, if you ask me if I'm supposed to answer, you know, I've always said I live in the present, and for me, the, you know, the immediate goal is something that's very important. So looking at the top of the ladder, I know it's the immediate step that's important, and that's something that will take us there. So we will, ha we will have to chalk out a plan, you know, for the three categories, you know, sport, super sport, and super bike. So we'll see how it goes, and definitely it's a big option for us.
वेल सपोर्ट सिर्फ आके चेहरे दिखाने से नहीं होता है देर अलॉट अबाउट जो विशेज मिलती हैं एंड इट्स ऑल अबाउट दैट एंड इफ यू सी इट वॉज अ वेरी सिंपल इवेंट यू नो हम यहाँ पे आके कुछ शो ऑफ नहीं करना चाहते थे सो यू नो हुआ वॉज फ्री केम एंड हुआ वॉज नॉट फ्री दे आर बिजी विद देयर ओन शेड्यूल्स sorry well if you see uh, as i said you know when the project popped up you know we were in australia at that point of time and the race was supposed to happen in philip island and as everyone knows you know uh, people call me a bike freak because of my you know love for the bikes and it was an opportunity for me to get into something that was uh, pretty new to me when it comes to taking it as a project but you know it was something that was very close to my heart and similar way when i launched my gym you know uh, it was something that was close to me so i said you know it's a project that i should definitely venture into especially the reason being the opportunity was there so that was the reason you know i got into it Uh, that plan is always on you know whatever the format or the sport you play in you know you always want to be the number one so it's a slow constant process and you know we are subject to it well it will be an interesting one you know uh, because if you see the england side they are a very good side but what's important is to focus on our strength and our weakness but also to improve over a period of time so you know uh, we report in another couple of days uh, and you know we have a few practice sessions before we get into the game so now i will take off from here because you have the riders and all the others with whom you can interact how many of your teammates in the cricket team are also bikers or are there no other bikers in the uh rohit is one i have to think because i have not interacted much but proper biking like rohit is one uh Praveen, to some extent, he likes bikes, and. What about the Baku Dosi man? Does he like it? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jadeja. So we'll keep it nice and simple. <laughs>